Now that your ProPulse ear irrigator is correctly set up and initial clean has been performed, it can be used. With the practitioner and patient sitting at the same level, a waterproof shoulder cape is applied around the patient's neck. This ensures they will be kept dry from water and debris. The single-use ProPulse Protect waterproof shoulder capes are available for purchase separately. Using warm tap water, the reservoir is filled up to the horizontal fill line. Be sure not to overfill so that you can easily move the unit without spilling. The reservoir lid is then fitted. Then firmly press the reservoir into place. The new single-use QRX tip is then placed into the handle by pushing the collar back, inserting the tip and releasing the collar as shown. Position your patient in a way that they can comfortably hold the newt's tank in place under their earlobe to collect water runoff. The machine is turned on and the pressure control is dialed to the minimum setting. The practitioner then uses a headlight to ensure visibility of the ear canal. Using the foot pedal starts the flow of water through the handle and out of the tip. The purpose of the irrigation procedure is to gently soften the earwax so that it can be easily removed with a scoop. The single-use ProPulse Pro Scoop can be purchased separately. If you observe a drop of water pressure or bubbles appear when in use, check that the reservoir is firmly pressed into place. If the problem remains, replace both the washer and mushroom valve being careful not to damage any pins. Please be sure to review and follow your local clinical guidelines before use. The machine is then turned off. The QRX tip is removed from the handle and together with the scoop and shoulder cape are safely disposed of. Finally, empty unused water from the reservoir and follow cleaning and maintenance procedure shown in the next video.